the thing that they're gonna have and you yeah. know, bacon and eggs and mushrooms and shit. Yeah. Nailed it. Uh, I see all the bacon eggs. That's see, like the I best breakfast. I, I would have been fine if TikTok oh, like it's they just renovated it, sure that's cool, you know, mm-hmm. but don't change the price of the food. Well, they, it's they so also had um, they they like started in the basement like right when they COVID and oh, yeah. they made the parking lot situation like on its own and so they would scare customers so they're parking at Trader Joe's which is already too tight and a bunch of accidents happen there and like the people getting sued because they weren't parking within where they actually were at so they had no defense and like it's crazy but yeah diners being ruined everywhere so you speak any English and you say it's really fancy or like very fancy I think it's really nice oh boy I'm gonna talk about Atlantic City what's that? I said I'm gonna talk about that. Yeah. Atlantic City is just like that. Oh, I was there. Here, Cody said double decker. Taco Puesto, that is Ponchos, like the best tacos I've ever had in my life. They have the chicky and beef and uh the tropicana at the mm-hmm. Del Mar. Yeah. So I forgot about that. When you walk on the boardwalk, you just see it all just yeah. like. And then they have Tony Luke's in the tropicana also, and that's fire. They so have Carmine's there too. Oh, you said you and oh yeah, yeah, I forgot about they that. They have a lot of really. No, good I think stuff. you got rid of the weird. It was there when the new stuff was there. They had the weird spread back in the day. Mm-hmm. And they just had weird Sounds stuff. Sounds good. Is it open? <laughs> Anybody saw that? Predictability, the milkman, the paper boy, evening TV. Welcome to NBA Jeopardy. We got a great show for you guys today. I'm your host, Ricardo Jefferson. Let's meet our contestants. From NBA's Mic'd Up, it's Jeremy Flats. Stephen Naismith from Disputed Takes. Good morning. And it's Flip Baymore from Disputed Takes. It's my turn. Thank you for joining us today, fellas. Now let's see our categories. We have who he play for. I'll give you an NBA player. You tell mm-hmm. me the team they play for. The game we love is now ruined. That's going to be questions about the modern NBA. NBA pop culture, pop culture in the NBA. And hey now, were you an all-star? I'll give you a player. You tell me if they were an all-star or not. Jeremy, you're closest to me. Why don't you start us off? I'll take who he play for for uh, 100 bucks. 100, here we go. Kelly Oubre Jr., who he play for? Talking about right now? Yes, <laughs> right now. Uh, the Charlotte Hornets. That is correct. The Charlotte Hornets. Kelly Oubre Jr. Jeremy, board. you still got the board. Let me see. The game we now love is, no, the game we love is now ruined for 100 bucks. Here we go. The first team to blow a 3-1 to <laughs> lead in the NBA Finals. Uh, uh, uh. Please pass the microphone. Steven Utah. Naismith is ready to steal. <laughs> Utah Jazz? That wait, hold on, wait, no, 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 no. Oh, you already guessed. Well, Utah on. Jazz. Hold Please on. pass wait, the microphone. Hold on. Wait a minute. Please pass Guess the microphone. <laughs> hey, it's not your turn anymore. It is the Golden State Warriors. <laughs> that is correct, the Golden State Warriors. On the board. Here we go. Uh, Steven, you got the board. I'm going to go with, hey, now, were you an all-star for 300? Hey, now, were you an all-star for 300? Richard yeah. Jefferson. Hey, now, was he an all-star? You know what, Ricardo Jefferson? I'm going to have to say that Richard Jefferson was at least one time an all-star. 
No. Please pass the microphone. Wow, wow. Well, Shocking. Well, you just gave us give, the answer, so yeah, can, no, Richard Jefferson was not. That is correct. An not an all-star. This is not how Jeopardy is played. <laughs> well, <laughs> we passed the microphone here in our NBA hey, Jeopardy. I'll take uh, pop culture. Right, we have that. Pop still? culture, yep. Yeah, I'll take that for uh, 600, 500. I There's mean, no 500. 600. There's no 600. 400, I mean. 400. Okay. You know what I meant? There we go. I can't read. In an episode of Full better. House, Uncle Jesse is taught basketball skills by this former Los Angeles Laker. Oh, man. you got to be kidding me. <laughs> It has to be Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. That is correct. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. The greatest center of all time. Beats me. Flip, you still got the board? Yeah, I'll take the pop culture for 300 now. Pop culture for 300. Here we go. In an episode of Sweet Life on Deck, Mr. Mosby's half-brother is played by this Orlando Magic. I'm going to have to go with Dwight Howard. That is correct. Dwight Howard. Flip's on fire right now. Here we go. Flip. Still got the board. I'm going to go, was he an all-star? Or whatever that hey is. Now. Hey, he now, were you an all-star for 400? 400, here we go. Jameer Nelson. Hey, now, was he an all-star? Jameer Nelson was an all-star with the Orlando Magic. That is correct. Jameer Nelson, an NBA all-star in I 2009. Am, I am the GOAT. Flip, you got a big lead, 1,400 points. All right, let's go to... Um, uh, let's see. The game we loved for 400. 400, here we go. The oldest player to drop 50 points in an NBA game. Oh, I, I absolutely, I absolutely know this. It, it has to be, it has to be Kobe Bean Bryant. Incorrect. Please pass the mic to Jeremy. Oh, you got to be kidding me. It's, it's, Jeremy? LeBron James? Incorrect. Here you go, Steven. A chance. Well, Jeremy stole my answer there, but I'm glad it's wrong, so he got to say it instead. I am going to say that's a tough one. It can't be, but I'm going to say it anyway. Steph Curry. Incorrect. It was actually Jamal Crawford. Well, I would not have guessed that. Mm. I think it was 39 or 40. He dropped 51. The king of six men. It's crazy. Here you go. Uh, Flip, you got the board still, oh, yeah. so. Hey, so um, I'll take a pop culture for 200. Pop culture for 200. Here we go. The Last Dance documentary is centered around this Chicago Bull. It is centered around. Get the camera on me right now. Put the camera on me right now. It is centered around the greatest basketball player ever, the GOAT, Michael Jeffrey Jordan. I got his Jordans on right now. It's Michael Jeffrey Jordan. That is correct. Michael Jordan is the answer. Flip. 1,600 points, still got the board. I'll take what team he oh, played hold for. Hold up, we got double jeopardy. Here we go. Please uh, name this NBA player behind you. Hey, that's my my man, Tavo Cephalo. That is correct, Jeremy. You got 300 points and the board. Here we well, go. Nobody's going to. Like I said, I want the what team he played for, for 400. For 400, here we go. Kessler Edwards. Wait a minute. That's not the Kessler. There's that he's Kessler. Been talking about. There's the Kessler right here. All right, I'm going to say, wait, I think he also played for the Utah Jazz. Incorrect. Please pass okay. the phone, microphone to Steven. Oh, for me? I'm going to say the Oklahoma City Thunder. Incorrect. Please pass to Jeremy. Oh. Jeremy, I know you love your Kessler, so. Utah Jazz. I, incorrect. I just Flip answered Utah. <laughs> What it's are you the Sacramento to, Kings. You're trying to steal my answer here? <laughs> he Come thought on, it was guys. so good, he'd say it twice. When okay. I hear Kessler, well, I it's, think It's Utah. my turn again, right? Uh, Flip still has the board, so. I love, I love owning this game. Here we go, Flip. I told you, it is my turn. You've got to turn the tables on Flip. You I'm going to go for Pop Culture 100. <laughs> Let's just clear it all out, man. Pop Culture for 100. The face of State Farm is this current Phoenix Sun. The old face of State Farm is the perennial choker. Chris Paul, number three, on the Phoenix Sun. That is correct. Uh, I, I disagree Paul. on the technicality. It is Cliff Paul. No. No, it was Chris and Cliff. Come there you on. Go. Sorry, but there Cliff you go. doesn't play on the Phoenix Sun. But Cliff <laughs> does not play. He's right. Sneaky. Here we go. He's right, Stephen. <laughs> you still got the board. 2,000 points. I am the king at this game. Um, let me get the game we loved. 
for 200. Can we all love it now, Ruin? Here we go. The fourth overall pick was booed at the 2015 NBA uh, draft. I have to rub it in my man's face right here. <laughs> he called the fans hoodwinked and bamboozled. It is Chris Stapp's Porzingis. Chris Stapp's Porzingis is correct. Pinger Zingus. Oh, you got receipts, huh? You got receipts. Yes, I, I, I do. <laughs> Pinger Zingus. Let's the do All Star for 100. All Star for 100. Here we go. Bradley Beal. Hey, now, was he an All Star? Wow. Of course he was. Come <laughs> he on. He was an All Star. How easy is this game? This I thought game that is was the gonna easiest thing ever. Because, you know, he was an All Star snub for many years. So, this is the but easiest thing I've ever done. 2,300 points. I guess that's for Michael Jordan, huh? This is for the GOAT, Michael <laughs> okay. Jeffrey Jordan. You're correct. It's 23, not 2,300. I will do. <laughs> I will do. Team he plays for 200. Team he plays for 200. Thomas Bryant, who he play for? He plays for the Los Angeles Lakers with the LeBum James. Incorrect. Pass oh. it to Steven. Man, I don't know any of these answers. I'm going to go with the Charlotte Hornets. Incorrect. Please pass it to Jeremy. Jeremy. You know what I'm going to say. The Utah Jazz, huh? The Utah Jazz. Utah Jazz. <laughs> well, that's incorrect. He's on the Denver Nuggets, guys. Oh. Now, who the hell cares about Denver? Yeah. Got the MVP. All I'll right, take my, my, my microphone back. Thank you very much. I will take that one for 200, the middle one, the 300. Hey, or no, you can do that yeah. one. Manny Ginobili. Hey, now, was he an all-star? I was the biggest beat reporter. Get the, mi get the camera on me. I was the biggest beat reporter for the San Antonio Spurs. So, yes, he was an all-star. Yeah, that's correct. He was an all-star. Manny Ginobili. Here we go. Two categories left. Flip. We will do the game I love, 300. 300, here we go. This current 76er is third in all-time threes made. Please back and pass the microphone to Jeremy. Ah, I didn't, I, Too much time. The answer is James Harden. Oh, that is correct. Wow. Well, he said Jeremy. I said Jeremy, too. Uh-oh. <laughs> but that's uh, correct. I'm mixing I'll, it up. I'll, Who you're handing it off to. I don't know who's I'll, getting I'll, it. I'll, yeah, take, yeah. Yeah. I'll take his Okay, point, uh, so. Jeremy, you get the last one. Here we go. Who we play for? 300. All right, I'll take him, I guess. Jock Landale, who he play wow. for? Wow. you going to give me the money. <laughs> who cares about Jock Landale? Who is this? Utah. <laughs> Utah Jazz is incorrect. Anybody want to guess? I'm going to say the worst team in the NBA, the San Antonio Spurs. He was on the Spurs, but not anymore. I'm going to say, I'm going to say Ricardo. Yep. I am going to say... <laughs> Please hurry up. You gotta say somebody. The Orlando Magic. No, that is incorrect. All of you guys, come on now. The Phoenix Suns. Oh. Uh, See, only you would know oh that. Oh boy. Well, we gotta go to commercial. We'll come back with Final Jeopardy. Well, long season, Kobe Bryant. Get it, Daddy. Well, uh, LeBron. Hey, I'm just saying. Okay, I'm ready. Well, 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 three three categories left. Postseason. Postseason. All right. Postseason back at you. I'll wager. Oh, chosen one. one. Ohio, just to baby. Just fun. Wow. Akron, Ohio, baby. So we can Come on, Ohio. Get it, Daddy. Let's do it. Woo! $20 time to eat food. What is mine? Playoffs, baby. 25? 25. Make some noise. Woo! Make some noise, Kobe. Come on, number oh 25. Oh, my God. Woo! Be me, bro. Nothing left. Here we go. Game right time, Kobe. Woo! Game time. What is the commercial? I need a basketball in my hand. Woo! And we're back. Now we got Final Jeopardy. Here's the wagers. 100 points is Jeremy Flats going to wager. 400 points, Steven Naismith. And with 2,500 points, he's going to wager it all. It's Flip Baymore. Final Jeopardy. Here we go. And I'm going to win it all. The Blazers traded Gerald Wallace to the New Jersey Nets oh for a 2012 first-round pick. God. Who did they select with that draft pick? <laughs> <laughs> Please write your answers. Here we go. Who did the Nets select? The Blazers select with that oh, pick. Oh, the Blazers in 2012. Oh, wait yep. a minute. 2012. 2012. Sneaky 
Mike Sneaky. Move to quit. Okay, everybody got their answers. Here we go. The Blazers traded Gerald Wallace to the New Jersey Nets for a 2012 first round pick. Who did they select with that draft pick? Jeremy. Lolo Lillard. Damian Lillard. I don't know. Okay. I don't know. Oh Chris? Boy. I mean, get it. oh, sorry. Steven. Steven. I Chris is my producer. Dame Dollar. Damian Lillard. Okay. <laughs> and flip. It was Damian Lillard. Oh, so, so we all tie again? Flip it. Oh, he CJ got it. McCollum. Oh. I always knew I was going to win the so show. No. Means Steven Nay. Smith. Steven no. Smith has Wait, won what? the what? first ever annual NBA Jeopardy Listen, game. Why did he win? Listen, How it only, I mean, it, it, it only it makes right. sense that the man points. who invented the game of basketball would win the this Jeopardy show unfair. about the game of Wait, basketball. This is unfair. Because, because, because he wagered I the want most a redo. Yeah. Yes. I, I wagered the most points. You to I, I, that, want that's, a redo. I doubled my 400 to 800. Well, you that's all we got today for NBA Jeopardy. From Ricardo Jefferson, Jeremy Flats, Stephen Naismith, and Flip Baymore. We'll see you never. I want to redo. I want to redo. I got it right. Okay. I thought we were all going to put wrong answers. <laughs> I want to tie it. I did it on purpose. Why didn't you make it more difficult? It was difficult. I knew it was Damien Lillard. I, because I was. I thought we were. I thought we were going for the. I thought we were going for the tie at zero.